I have actually made a bequest to the BSR in my will. Um, I've had a will for quite a long time, partly because I don't have any close family, so I've had to think about who gets what. And also um, because I want to show my appreciation for several organisations that have helped me become the person I became and have the life that I have. Um, the BSR, because I love them so much and they are stationed in the city that has given me my wonderful life, um, seemed an obvious, an obvious choice. Because I value what they do so much, I want to encourage them. Interestingly, I never actually studied at the BSR, partly because my subject's English. And I think anyway, when I was young, I would have been too shy to go and study abroad. But once I started to write... It happened by pure chance that the editor who gave me my first break at Woman's Realm, the women's knitting magazine, had a son who was an archaeologist who was an award holder at the school. And um, she instructed him that he had to help me. So began the process, which still continues, that when there's something I want to see in Rome that's not readily accessible to the public, I persuade the school to help me get to have a look. And sometimes they know about things that I might not have heard about. And over the years, by, by strange circumstance, therefore, I have ended up with a huge affection for this institution, institution and, and a great admiration for what they do. One of the things I have to think about as a writer is that it doesn't all end with my initial probate. There will be income, I hope there will be income for the full term of copyright on my books and that in fact at the moment subject to Brexit is 70 years. So I needed to think what was to happen to the ongoing income that would come in and I have included the British school in that as well because it's a way that even when I'm gone I can continue to do what I consider to be something worthwhile.